Hey guys, it's Lomax here, and today we're going to be starting a brand new Let's Play. We're going to be doing some Borderlands 1. Now, I thought, you know, we're a couple months out from Borderlands 3. I thought it'd be a cool idea to revisit this series, so along with this, my plan is to also do playthroughs of Borderlands 2 and pre-sequel. But I figured we'd start out with the original and we're going to be playing as Roland. So let's go ahead and start up a character. All right, so we're back in the wonderful world of Pandora. If you can call it that. You know, it's pretty, pretty barren wasteland, but, you know, it's it's got its quirks, I guess. <laughs> kind of like the mustache. Kind of like a... I kind of like Ned's mustache, honestly. You know what? We're going to do a... Uh... We're not Roland anymore. We're Noland. Totally not Roland. Alright. So. Apparently, if we walk ten feet away from Claptrap, he starts talking through the Echo. That's kind of weird. So let's just try and stay close. So. Psych, we're gonna actually go loot stuff now that he's uh hang on. Trigger that? Okay. Now we're gonna go loot stuff. Let's see if we get any usable. Nice eh, we got a sniper rifle we can't use yet, a repeater. Take that repeater for now. And we're back just in time. It almost works out perfectly as long as you uh don't screw up the jump onto the building. Which, yeah. I'm like 50-50 on. I, I get it most of the time, but I guess most of the time it's not 50-50, but half the time then. So one nice feature with the remaster is auto pickup. You can't pick, you won't pick up stuff from safes and money boxes, but you can pick up uh, anything on the ground, which is nice. Any, any ammo or any money. All right, let's take a look in here. We got a Hyperion repeater and a Torg repeater. Hyperion repeater looks pretty tasty. All right, clock drop. Say your thing. Wow! Thank you. That looks like it could do some damage. Okay, let's get this gate open. One thing I do like is that you can uh, can't see your reload because early game you don't have any proficiencies or anything, so reloading can kind of be a little bit of a pain. Especially with sniper rifles, so meleeing to animation cancel is pretty nice. You just gotta pay attention to when you're actually reloaded like that. Once your clip is full, just melee. The almighty Zed. Not a real doctor. Opening her up again. All right, Clappy, lead the way. Still here. You got to be right on his face for him to go forward. Basically, babysitting him. under nine toes skin. Don't worry. He'll get what's coming to him. Ah, oh, Claptrap. Right Always choice. dramatic. Oh, the poor little robot needs our help. Would you kindly give him a hand? If only Angel knew what happens in Borderlands 2 with Claptrap. I don't think she'd call him a poor little robot. Probably just be sick of him at that point. That little robot is hurt. He isn't going to last very long without attention. Why don't you look around for something to fix him up? Don, Angel. Am I leaving? Get with the program here. Seems to be okay. Now is the time to get moving and play your part in the journey to come. Alright, are we gonna just kill some skags? Shouldn't be too hard. In before I die to skags. No, it'd be pretty, pretty embarrassing. 
If I died to these gags, I'd probably just restart. <laughs> Give me a shout if I can help you. Getting better all the time. Let's grab a shield. So we gotta go get this power coupling, put it in the vendor, and then we can buy a shield. Should be more than a few skags over here. Pretty easy. Actually, we probably can just run in and run out. Well, let's kill some stuff, shall we? We're gonna throw this on. We're gonna grab the shield. Might not have a med school degree, but when can't buy shot, that one, but we can buy these. Here. And I mean, there's not really a big difference between these. Well, I guess it kind of is. It's like twenty percent more shield capacity. I'm gonna kind of ignore these guns. I'm gonna leave them behind there. Honestly, you know what? I'm gonna sell these. But personally, I think the legendaries that they put. In this game, like new ones are just way too strong. You can call me Everyone else does. Okay, so right now we're actually gonna go to T Bone Junction uh, because we can get some extra XP. The quests here are level 35, and we can do the first two without actually dying. So we're gonna skip that cutscene. We're gonna, yeah, we see. must speak immediately. Hopefully, I'm we don't die. I'm afraid for my own security, and therefore you must jump through a hoop or two. Talk to the mechanic; he knows where to find me. Right, and a word of caution: don't touch him if you ever want to eat with your hands again. So, as you can see, level 35, impossible. But we're gonna prove otherwise. Wow, look how hard that was. Alright, we're gonna do another one. So yeah, this is a really nice way to get some XP if you, uh, if you want to. You don't have to do this, but it helps you get your action speed a little faster. So we're gonna do it. That's part number two. Now, you gotta be careful, because these guys... I'll get to work we'll on that. Pretty right much now. one shot you with the health gate you, so we're gonna we're gonna run. We're gonna run. We're gonna run fast, hopefully, and not get hit. They see me. Oh, okay. There's part number three. There's a chest over here we're gonna get. We've got a couple of guns in it, and we're not gonna be able to use them because again, they're gonna be like level 35. Somewhere around there. But we can sell them. Oh, it's one launcher. But look at that. Look how much money we're gonna get. Seventy-three thousand dollars. At this point in the game, is a lot of money. Hey, one of them crimson bucket sluts did a number on my hand. Oh, look. Another level thirty-five quest print. done. Now, I didn't tell him nothing, but I can't install anything right now. All right, so we can put a point in our action skill. Uh, now we have a super cool turret. And we're gonna get another impossible to do quest done. Man, we're awesome. Right. We're gonna need that quest for later because we're gonna come back and do this DLC eventually. But um, we're gonna head out back to Firestone for now. So I kind of have an idea of what I want to do for Roland's build. I think we're just gonna go gun damage for a little bit. We're gonna pick up like Impact, then Metal Storm, which will give us good damage. Um, especially on kill, because this kill skill is amazing. And then we're going to go down, I think, a little bit of this tree, try and get some health regen, and probably continue back down this tree uh, a little bit later. But, we're I mean, we're going to have... I think you get 69 skill points in this game, because you can get two from... Or you get four from DLCs. So. And there's only so many skills. So we're going to have a lot of skills. Okay, I'm pretty sure we... Because it's a story mission, I think we already... Yeah, we already picked that up, so we're gonna go talk to... Or no, we don't talk to anyone yet, we just kill bandits. Which will be really easy with the action skill, though. Kill him. Kill him now. Target hit. Oh. Oh. All we need to do is throw our turret down, and this is pretty much gonna do everything for us. I'm not sure if your turret has full, full 360 degree range, or if it's just 180. Near 180? Not entirely sure. Come on, turret. 
Ah, uh, these guys are behind cover. It might be a little difficult. Oh, we have a couple grenades. We can throw that out. Throw that out. That's probably not going to hit anyone. Oh, it did. It hit that guy. The gore in this game, too, is top notch. Okay. Is there something you need? Another quest down. Almost level 7. So one thing that kind of... It's kind of annoying about... More, I'd say more so the early game, is you're just doing a lot of back and forth between, like, Zed and whatever, you know? Like, he doesn't he doesn't send you out to do, like, multiple things at once. You kind of just go out, do one thing, come back, do another thing, come back, do another thing, come back. But it's more because of the things he's having you do or, like, take no time at all. That's what makes it kind of annoying, you know? If it were styled like Borderlands 2, you'd have... You know, you go do one thing, then you go do another thing, then you do another thing, then you do another thing, and then you go back. Not the way it is in this game. You! One more step and it'll be your last! <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> TK, hey, what a joker. Why don't you come over here and chat a while? Right, we gotta go pick up his food because you know he can't really get around because he's blind. It's kind of hard. I'm amazed he survived on Pandora this long, honestly. I guess the shotgun helps, but I mean, that can only help so much. He's still need to get food and do other stuff. Well, I guess I'm getting his food, so maybe he doesn't need to get food. All right, we got all the food. We're gonna head back and turn this puppy in. Smells like. Off-worlder. How you like it off planet anyways? Well, we got another point. We're gonna throw another point down into impact. Keep going down well, that tree towards Metal Storm. I decided to reopen my Firestone franchise thanks to you. Oh, thanks, Marcus. And buy some new gear. What a nice guy. So we just have to get a grenade here. Marcus was kind enough to reopen his supply shop. We'll check to see if there are any good guns, because, again, we're gonna... We can sell this rocket launcher, we're gonna have a lot of money. What do we have for guns? We got a Nash repeater. That's pretty cheap. I think I'm just gonna buy it. I mean... We're gonna have enough money. We'll check to see if we can get a better shield, too, because... Why not? I might not have med school degree, but when you get shot, you'll be happy I'm here. Alright, new shield. New repeater. And we gotta turn this into TK. Alright. We got grenades. TK's got his food. We gotta go kill nine toes. Alright, everybody. That's gonna do it for this video. In the next one, we're gonna end up going into Skag Gully, taking on nine toes. And hopefully coming out a little stronger. We'll see. I'll see you in the next one.